So how long have you guys been teaching IELTS? Uh, ladies first, I guess. <laughs> I think around four, four or five years. I think so, because I don't really keep track. So I think that's an appropriate number of time, I, I think. Four or five years, half yeah. a decade. Uh, that's quite a coincidence, because uh, I've been teaching for like around four to five years as well. You started very young then, because you, you're sh certainly younger than me. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> okay. Very nice energy from the beginning. So you are obviously very passionate about languages, and especially English. So how do you all turn your passion into a career path? I think it's... Uh, I think it's more like a coincidence. I think it's uh, some sort of uh, fate, yes. uh, because well, first of all, this is something I this is something I think I should disclose. I actually am dyslexic. Mm -hmm. I have dyslexia, which is I don't think a lot of people in Vietnamese uh, a lot of Vietnamese people believe it exists. Because wow. when I was younger, where I couldn't really read. Mm -hmm. And um, it's really difficult for me to actually remember alphabets or just any wow. letters. So um, everybody actually believed that I was a little bit dumb. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, so I just started to learn more and more to prove to people that, hey, I, I also have a brain. I'm not really like just a pretty doll for you to play with. And when I actually went overseas and I did get myself checked and I was officially announced to have dyslexia. So I think it's mostly uh, the journey of me attaining this score in IELTS and becoming a teacher is just like my journey of fighting yes. the condition that I have. Because I also studied literature, which is something that mm -hmm. nobody even believes that someone with dyslexia would do. But yeah, I did that. So I think it's mostly uh, serendipitous kind of like turning point in life that nice. I did that because I used to be in um, art and fashion. Wow, that's yeah. very inspiring. This is the first time I know something about you, even though yeah. I've known you for a while. Yeah, um, it's uh, something I don't really talk about. Yeah. Now it's time to study IELTS.